Go to BB. Hey guys. Come on. We are leaving the house early. Just guess what we're doing. Guess what Vin and Adventure Vin is taking us on. The movies. Yeah. Come on. Come on. He really wants, what is this movie even called, Vin? Quiet Place. Yeah. Vin wants to bring me and Briella to see A Quiet Place. Let's go. Let's go. A scary movie. <laughs> Stop, stop, go. It's the go. baby version. It's the one they make, uh, they make it lower and the lights are on. Yeah. So, I don't know why he's taking us to this. But, I'll probably just like take real out of the movie the entire time. So, it's a big waste of time, to be honest. But, uh, he just like doesn't get it. So. Oh, so yeah, um, so it is like a few days later. It's July now, um, from the last thing. I showed you guys at the end of last vlog, hanging those pictures, and when I tell you guys, it, I mean, if you've ever let, I don't know, it's just such a long wall. The wall is literally like a little over 12 feet. I'm trying to just, measure on where you want to put these pictures like precisely and like getting like the measurements <laughs> Hi, baby. plus i didn't have um like i didn't have vin's help because he was working and obviously like he was doing overtime and all that stuff and like i was obviously impatient i just wanted to hang them uh so it was hard and then hard with her too because obviously she wants to see what I'm doing be in that hallway. So it's like I could only do measure and do things and like try to place things perfectly. I even got this laser thing that didn't work because the hall's too narrow. Um, and it's like diagonal. So it was just really honestly hard, but it looks good, so I'm happy. Come on, baby, you want this? You wanna play with it? Good job. Open. Close. Good job. Oh. Okay. In my eye. Yes. Okay. Here. Let mommy clean your eye, please. Ow. Oh my god. Ow. Oh, Briella. So unnecessary. Uh, so yeah, oh my God. everything's always running. If anyone who follows here, who's following along on our life journey, has a constant runny nose and runny eyes, please tell me what you did for this. It's been like my whole life. I just don't know why I'm always leaking. To dig it out. It's literally the most annoying, inconvenient like situation. If I even like. My eyes water all the time anyway, My, like it's all the time everything's leaking, but if I even in the wind go outside, like, forget it. It's, I, if you follow, you've heard this a million times, but it's just so annoying. And now I have like water juice in my eye. Whew. Um, so yeah, I don't know what we're gonna do for the rest of the day, but we are gonna be like in that same area that we're always in, so I'm sure we'll walk around. We do have to do a Costco order, because we need water too. Like, there's too many things now that we need. So, like, if you want to stop, like, into Traders, we can, but. Um, Get that Traders water. Yeah. And then Vin over here, why don't you share your latest issues? That's He's been I'm working out, and he has, like, a, what do you think, you have tendonitis? I mean. We all match, though, guys. And we didn't plan this at all, <laughs> which is really <laughs> weird. I mean, that's what my dad said. I have like pain right here. I'm working out. I'm so. working out, but I took Motrin last night. It's kind of working. Yeah. I think I'll just take some more today. See if I knock it out. Yeah. I feel like you always have like such a random like, thing. Well, then I did arms last night and I went light. I went light too because of it and I'm still like... Yeah, still, maybe like, you just up. need a break. Like I had to take Motrin after. Yeah. Or you need to get one of those like 
like icy patches or like something. Like what helps tendonitis? Like I don't know. I never do that so like for the thumbnail but okay guys we're off i don't know what today holds probably a lot of the same but um you know like always it's 100 degrees here in texas so we can't do much but um we'll see where the day takes us belly baby <laughs> is getting bigger and bigger thank goodness but um yeah crazy Crazy belly baby, right? <laughs> All right guys, we just got here. It's 100 degrees. Ben is not having this hot weather. Everyone and their mother decided on this Tuesday morning at 11 a.m. they wanted to come here. It is packed. We got a spot so far away, but we're here. Well, everyone comes to see the, you know. The, yeah, because it's the kid times, but no. This whole parking lot can't be parents with their kids. This is crazy. It might be. You they're, think? All, they're all probably seeing inside out. Yeah, maybe. This is crazy. But we already saw that, right, Bree? Yeah, so, yeah, let's, let's take us to see some weird alien movie. We go see the good stuff. <laughs> Brielle fell asleep in the car, so we'll see how this goes. Oh. I gotta show this guy the thing though. So. Okay. I'm just trying to hold this baby. You can just walk in. I'm still here. Oh, okay. <laughs> Come, here we go. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> Hi, cutie. Alright, movie finished. This was a rough one for Brie, guys. Yeah, it goes down careful, yeah, careful, careful. Oh, you did good, Brie. Good job. Alright, going for a walk in the 100 degree weather. <laughs> what did we think of the movie? I thought it was good. I, don't, I think it's probably the worst one out of the three but yeah. still i mean they're all good though don't laugh at me that i had no idea what we were seeing like ben never told me that this i'm like such an idiot too because like it's the same name as the other two movies i, I had no idea that this was the prequel to the quiet place one and two like i yeah, was I just saying the alien movie the alien yeah movie. he just kept saying aliens to me and i was like i i thought it was a movie i never heard of but yeah. But it was good. It was a little awkward in the beginning because the couple next to us heard Briella like make a noise and was like, are you kidding me? And I kind of, you know, Yeah, but then the movie it got a little theater. awkward, but yes, it is. We went, it's the kid friendly movie. But then on the screen, it like flashes like, oh, this is the baby movie. Yeah. Like if you don't like it, get a refund. Yeah. So that made me uh, feel a lot better about that. Because I, they were just like, oh, you, you kind of heard them like saying something. But honestly, like the way they do that is really cool. Cause, yeah. Like, this time, this movie, you could really tell that it's a lot lower. Oh yeah. Right. Thank God. You could tell it's like honestly, way lower. Now when we go to normal movies, I'm like, oh it's too my loud. gosh, exactly. it's so loud. <laughs> like it's horrible. I don't. I hate it. I don't. I don't like loud noises. Honestly, I don't like. Like, I just don't, I don't it know. It is weird. Like, a couple times we went to, like, a normal movie, and we're like, oh, my God, this is, like, this yeah. is crazy. I, like, hate it, honestly. Like, Planet of the Apes. This when is so much started, better. We were like, what the hell? Yeah, I was like, course. I literally was like, I need earplugs. <laughs> Look how cute. Got the little ducks out here. It's so nice over here. So nice. Briella refused to nap, though. She, uh... I had to walk away with her for a while. She uh, wasn't having it, and I didn't want to be rude to the other people, so like I did walk away, and I changed her. I went to the bathroom, and we just kind of like walked around. But um, Briella. See what I mean? She's not thrown off by the movie at all. You kept saying we can't take it to see well, that. Well, because scary. I thought Vin care. made it seem like we were going to see a horror movie, and I was like. I can't bring my, I literally was yelling at him. I couldn't, I was like, how could you even think to bring your 15 month old to a horror movie? Like, 
what's wrong with you? And uh, he just failed to tell me that we were seeing a quiet place. So. Yeah, had no clue. No clue. Hopefully Briella naps now. And then, as always, we're gonna walk around the nice little town because this is what we do. You know? It's just so fun. Why not? Hey guys, back in the car. Had a little meltdown before because I honestly was really stupid, obviously. Like, why have a meltdown? But guys, they filled my match up to here and the rest was foam from Starbucks. Like, I, she, what did she do? You saw her, like, she, like, shook it up. No, she blended it. Yes, yeah, so it was instead all foam. Of, instead of just shaking it, which is kind of weird. I've never seen that before. Because she poured it out of the blender. Yeah, thing. like, not a big thing to, like, obviously like flip out about but at the same time like Starbucks is like you spend it's like a treat and you literally I got literally as soon as it went in my hand I was like why is this so light in a venti cup like that's so weird you know You're cutting down on the matcha it's just like rude but I paid for it <laughs> to be a venti you know what I mean yeah. like you can't cut down on something I literally paid for to be big it's so stupid but um so instantly annoyed about that. But yeah, we um it's too can't, you can't you can't walk around. It's we're dying. Briella is like sweating. She's so all red with sweat. Yeah. I, I have like a little fan right there going for her. She's sleeping, so I'm nervous with the fan, so I sat back cold there at on. first. Oh I forgot you about never, the cold bath. I forget. Um with like holding the fan, but since she's sleeping, I put it up. I'm just so scared that she's gonna stick her little fingers in there. But then we went into Trader Joe's again to pick up some more stuff. We literally go through food like, you know, obviously I'm home, all, I'm home, but we eat the same things. You know, it's like, but we eat it all. Like none of our food goes to waste. We really <laughs> do eat all of it, but we just had to pick up some essentials like milk, eggs, and that stuff. And we got like a cool like olive oil, organic sourdough pizza thing Vin's friend told him about. Um, yeah, Trader says, Traders has some good stuff. Yeah. The thing with Traders is it's so cheap somehow. Yeah, like we kind of, uh, yeah, we were we didn't know if we were just gonna do a Costco order or that, but Costco is like two hundred dollars every time we order it. And, and I feel like we still go through it in like yeah. a week. Yeah. And we're trying really hard to like save our money because we know we're gonna like we're going to LBI soon, and we're obviously gonna spend money on that trip. We have to get the tickets. You know, it's just kind of like. Where do you spend? Obviously, we need food. So traders might be the way to go for like. For we a are, bit. We're always over there, so it's not yeah. like you know. So I mean, fifty-seven bucks for like everything yeah, we, got we got. A lot. Like a, we got a decent amount. You know, we didn't get any like meat or fish. Well, we have that. I'm just saying, yeah, like that's yeah. why the price yeah. was good. But still, like I could buy a shirt for that amount. Of money, so <laughs> like, it kind of you know, money is honestly wild. I feel like I talk about it all the time on here, but like. Nah, grocery stores are like mad expensive now. They are, but I don't know. Just money in general is such like a wild thing. Like everything is so expensive. I mean, Costco is minimal, hundred twenty, like, yeah. easy. Minimum, like that's if we just get like the basics. Yeah. It's just ridiculous. if you get any meat or anything at all, you're running yeah. it up to running it up over two hundred. Yeah, it's just freaking crazy. I don't know. But yeah, there's like really nothing else to do. Like we're just gonna go back home now. That's just, it's too hot. Like Texans, how do you survive? What do you do? Like, what do you guys do? I wanna know what I Texans do. Time, That's why we don't ever see any people. Yep. We never see anyone. Like we're always like, where is everyone? Like they just stay home, I guess. So and like, I'm home all week. Yeah, yeah, it's true. You do see them like at night and stuff, but I'm home all week. Like I wanna get out of the freaking house. You know, Vin is different, like, you know, I get a little annoyed with him sometimes because I'm like, I want to go do all these things. Obviously, I'm stuck at home because we only have one car. And, but Vin is out in the heat all the time. Like, you know, he obviously doesn't want to do that. So, we're going to be so happy when we go to New York in August and, like, it's perfect weather, like, perfect beach town, like, summer, normal summer weather. Like, I'm so excited to be able to breathe. It's just, like, 80. Like, 80 yeah. would be, like, the difference between now, like, 80 and, like, 
95 or 80 and 90 is ridiculous. It's huge. It's so crazy. Like, I kind of wish we could just stay in New York for the whole summer. You know? Like, at, with our families, you know? And then you need a summer house away from here. Yeah. Like, sometimes I'm like, but people, I was going to say, because we were between when we were moving, Florida and Texas. And I like, I by now, but I like shot Florida down. I lived the, there a little bit when I was younger. And like in my, you know, when I lived there, it's like, it rains every five seconds. It's so humid, like where we lived. So humid, like your hair is a poof ball. But like you have the have beaches, which like I kind of like didn't think about. I didn't know like Galveston was just like a strip of like, be you know, like, uh, you know, if you know, you know, but like, you know, so sometimes I'm like, oh, I feel like I like made the wrong choice because like, <laughs> I really like was not in, like, I just didn't want to deal with that. But Texas is so much like Florida. It's crazy with the weather. Is it, We literally moved to the most humid area. So it's the same thing with the poof hair. It's, it's like so hot here. It's actually like a, it's like the Sahara Desert. It's crazy. Anywhere, dude, anywhere, anywhere <laughs> that borders can, the Gulf is gonna be like that. Yeah, so, but every, like, it's just a summer. Like, it really is very nice. It being, it, it, all the other months are nice, so. Yeah, the whole winter's You have great. to get through the summer. The summer's just rough. And it's hard being pregnant in the summer anyway. <laughs> and now I'm like trying to serve, you're already hot and sweaty and disgusting, so now like, I have a freaking big belly. Everything is big. I have these bigger boobs. All this stuff I have to deal with <laughs> in dripping sweat, 100 degree weather. So it's just great. It's just great. So yeah, that's my rant about that. Um, we're going back home now. I don't know what we'll do for the rest of the day. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe we'll go to the pool. Maybe we won't. We gotta say. It's just so hot. Like if we want to get out of the house, that's like really all we can do. But it's not fair to like Briella to be out in this heat because it's just, she's like a little ball of sweat right now. So whatever we do, we will take you guys along. Hey guys, back home. So out of breath from bringing all this stuff up. Yeah, you got your little lemon. Oh, I feel so bad for Briella, she's like sweating. But I got a really exciting package in the mail. Um, so I had to go all the way back down, all the way to the mail room, in this heat. I'm like, like dripping. I know we say this every time, but it's like not natural here. It's like just not. But guess where it's from? I'm like so excited. Okay. So cute cute little packaging. I wanted this, guys. I obviously got the new phone case. I wanted it so bad. And like it sold out immediately. And I was so upset because when it first came out, first of all, it's really like the phone case. I don't have anything else from this company or anything. Like I'm not like a, you know, nothing against Haley Bieber. Nothing like, I'm not like a huge fan. You know, I just, uh, like, I just, you know, I'm not really, I don't care. <laughs> but when I saw this phone case when it first came out, like the gray one, I I wanted it so bad because how cool is that? You know, but it was gray and I'm like really not into gray. Honestly, I know you have no idea what this is, but like hair on me and probably every time I film, I have things all over my face and stuff. Sorry guys. But yeah, long story short, I really wanted this phone case, but yeah. Didn't, didn't get it when it was the right one and then it sold out and I was like oh that's like that sucks you know but I kind of like was just checking the site every so often and it came back so I got the little lippy case thing um it had to happen it was fate that I went on the website again I had to have it like look Guys, I'm obsessed with having, you know, like a chapstick or like a lip gloss, like something on me and I can never find them. They're always lost. Like, I don't know what happens, but like how perfect. Come on, look. How perfect is it? Yeah, you just did. How perfect is this? It's a phone case with a lip gloss on it. Like, 
and it fits like other ones too, so you know. Uh, where's my phone? Right over here. You left it. Why you called me? Nah, but I thought you were gonna go through the front gate. I was you like, know, now, now she can't. I leave it every time. You know, every time I walk the O2, I was I'm like, oh my god, I can't check the mail. Okay, let's see. I'm so excited about this. I don't uh like buy phone cases like literally ever oh my god it's so perfect and i really wanted this color does this even like fit i guess maybe it's supposed to be like that i got the one for my phone let's make sure 15 pro max yeah who knows but yeah so i'm like so happy i know it's like a stupid purchase but i wanted it so bad but I hated the gray. And then when they came out with new colors, I wanted a color not just for summer that would go into like all seasons. I get really sick of things very easily. Like, oh, she's so out of it. Baby, it's okay. I gotta change your diaper. Yeah, so I'm like so, I don't know, just like a little fun thing. I'm so excited. It seems so stupid, but it's the little things in life that make you happy. It wasn't expensive. So, you know, but so cool that I'm so happy I got it, guys, because I did not, I completely went, did not go on the website at that time or do anything, you know. But they restocked fast. Okay, okay, come here, my baby. Come here. My poor baby is just out of it. She's just done. She's had so much water today too. Like, I'm very proud of her. You like my new phone yeah. case? <laughs> you like it? Yeah, it's so beautiful. Oh, and I'm just so happy. Like, it's just so convenient for me. Cause you really, sometimes you just only have your phone. And then I, you know, if you're a chapstick or a lippy girl, like this is the case. I know they make ones you can get it on Amazon. It's not. It's like a, you know, whatever. It's like a dupe for it and stuff. But I wanted the real one, okay? I just wanted the real one. That's all I wanted. So, yeah. That uh, is my fun purchase. I'm dying. I need to cool off. It is. I just can't, I can't get over this heat. This is just absolutely ridiculous. We got basically the same things we got last time at Trader Joe's, or I'd show you. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna change you now. Okay, okay, I'm gonna change you. All right. Baby duties, guys. Gotta go. Hey, guys. It's the next day. Next morning. Out and about. We're doing errands today. Oh, it's the day before the 4th. Vin annoyingly has to work on the 4th. So, not that we, like, really would have done anything. Yeah. You know, but still. It's annoying. Because he wasn't supposed to. But, um, so yeah, we're just going to the bank and then we have to go to Target because I need to get diapers because we didn't end up getting Costco and I'm running low and I don't know if I should get her size three or size four now because she's 22 pounds. So I don't really know what to do about that situation. But yeah, so now we're just heading to the bank. Briella is in the back. Having her juice. juice. And yeah, we're just out and about today. I don't know. How much we're gonna do it's again like just so hot out i just like can't yeah these days you just don't even want to be yeah out. it just sucks like i just live in this apartment like for months upon end it's so it, it's just summer go, here is almost like winter depression but it's going sucks. from the car yeah it's true like, it's almost like winter depression in the north yeah just going from the apartment to the car you're like drenched just putting yeah. rail in the car seat i'm like drenched i'm freaking out yeah, it's just like too much. And then like everything we want to do is inside, so we just always end up spending money too. It's like, yeah, it kind of sucks. But we've talked about this forever. Apparently this whole vlog is literally about how much Texas weather just is not for us. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so we'll take you along on whatever we do. All right, going into Target, finally. Hey, baby. Different target. You like this one better. Alright. Oh. Baby. 
Do you want to look at the Disney stuff? What do we got here? Wow. It's Olaf. Olaf. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> no reaction? Not like Olaf? Got to give her like yeah, mini or something. Frozen. Is there a mini? Oh, here's mini. Or a Pluto. She likes dogs. You like, it. You like doggies? Pluto? Doggy? Pluto? <gasps> Doggy! Woof woof woof. Look at his tongue. She's thinking about it. <laughs> Briella is obsessed with um, her pig stuffed animal oh, yeah. that I got before she was born, but it's kind of getting like so raggedy and I got it at Target, so I was trying to find like another one, like a backup, but I can't find it. But she's obsessed with like only that pig, so like it's hard. Like she'll play with her other stuffed animals, but to sleep and when she's like tired or anything, like she needs the pig. So it sucks. I cannot, I don't think they even sell it anymore. I checked online. I don't know where this pig came from. How I got it here, but I don't know. We need to go to the diapers. We're going to the toy. Oh. Like any of these guys? Whoa. That little pink monster looks cute. Is this a shark? Did you put your hand in? I can. Back in the car, we're actually getting Starbucks. I do this every time. I always think I have more time to speak. <laughs> Maybe I do, I don't know. Let's hope they get this mantra right today, guys, and I, I don't get some foam. Anything that triggers my anger is like a no-no. <laughs> Yellow's looking in the mirror. Is she? Vivi, what are you doing? I love you. Uh, but anyway, at Target, I was trying to find, like, because she's been wearing. Um, can I just get, can I get a venti iced matcha with whole milk? Whole milk. Um, no, and just yeah. another venti cold brew with heavy cream. That's it. All right, thank you. I feel like our, the price goes up every time we go to Starbucks too, right? The person's like sleeping also. Like 12? It used to be like, oh, remember it used to be like 8, then 9, then it was 10, and now 12? I know. Like, what goes on? Two cold brews used to be like maybe 10 bucks. Yeah, well now I get a matcha, so I don't know, matcha is a little more expensive, but still like $12 for like coffees. Guys, who can survive out here? <laughs> like, I don't know who's surviving. And if you get, if you get any food, it's like, you know, oh my you, can, God. you can run, run oh, it yeah. up to like 25 bucks. Oh yeah, easy, easy if you get food. But anyway, at Target, I ended up getting the Millie Moon diaper size three for her. We haven't used Millie Moon since she was like so, so, so small. Um, and then we just ended up going with the Costco diapers because they were just so much easier. You know, they get delivered to your door. It was just like so easy. Um, I, always, I really want to try like the Coterie. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but those diapers, I want to try them because Briella now, I mean, Millie Moon runs big. It, their size three actually went to 24 pounds, which is why I got the size three. But um, she has accidents like through the night now. She's drinking like so much like water and Did like she do milk that last and stuff. Night too? No, last night she oh. didn't. Because I've been trying to time her bottles and stuff now earlier so that she she doesn't. But sometimes she wakes up and I'm like, she she doesn't care. She she could care less. But I'm like, I have to do all the sheets. I have to do all for pajamas. It's like, ew, you know? Like, I've, I don't want her sleeping in that. And I feel so horrible. But it's crazy because I change her diaper right before she goes to sleep every time. Like, you know, I, I don't know. So 
I know some people get like night diapers, but I know coterie diapers are supposedly like the best. So just something like I wanna like eventually try or, you know, cause it, that's also like a delivery service. It just makes it so much easier, yeah, you know? Cause also like at Target, like of course, like what do I do? I look at the clothes, like I'm looking at everything. <laughs> We ended up getting like dino nuggets for Briella that have like no oils in them Because the Costco ones do and we don't really you know. Pretty much all of them do. I mean, it's hard. Yeah, it's so hard to get things like clean and I don't know. It's just gotta get know, Purdue. Every so often You know, you gotta do what you gotta do but like if it just I don't know I get so weird with like the things that she eats You know and to me too like I don't know I don't know why no one cares about like these things, but not that no one cares, but like these companies, I don't know. I guess it's just cheaper to make it those ways. I don't know. I don't know. What are you saying back there? It's Briella. <laughs> just having a grand old time. <laughs> Bri, what are you saying? Where are you? She's so cute. Yeah. Can we also just get a uh, pup cup? Ooh, Titi's getting a treat? I feel bad. We like leave him alone now a lot. Oh, yeah. I want to go out for the day. He'll be very happy. Is this still zooming? He gets, yeah. he gets yelled at a lot. <laughs> How rude. Thank you. That was directed towards me. Honestly, like I said, it's like my pregnancy rage is out of control, guys. And every night when I go to sleep, I'm like, I have to be nicer tomorrow. I literally give myself a whole pep talk. I'm like, I need to get better. I need to be nicer. Like, it's not that big of a deal. With Theo, it's more like he's a very yappy, barky dog, especially like if he wants something and if there's food involved and feeding Briella is like very hard with her throwing everything on the floor so I and then Theo just eats it all and I'm like okay cool that that was her dinner <laughs> so yeah I mean Ben just called me out but like I guess I deserve it thank you thank you Man, I think it's foam again that's just how no. they make it now no 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 it's oh there's there's some foam. Out, it's on the side doing to me see i mean but at least it's at the top the last time was half foam honestly i think that's how they do it now. i get it because like okay I, that's how you made it but would you really like you know would you really do that to someone who just spent like however much like what is this i guess 12 let's just say this is a little over six dollars you know no i don't think it's six dollars well it was 12 something well with tax so yeah they're both maybe. like five they're both like 525 or okay but still like i don't know that's like it's just not nice you know what i mean you gotta start going to dutch bros no i'm not going to dutch bros dutch bros is good yeah is it i don't know no, people like isn't it like know, duncan people, a lot of people like see it online or like on tiktok and they're like oh my god i wish we had like chris yeah like his friends my like, friend chris was like oh my god you have a dutch bros <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I steer clear for a minute. <laughs> yeah. yeah. My wife hates it. Yeah. That's all I can say. Then, if I liked fast food and stuff, I feel like we'd be 500 pounds. <laughs> because I <laughs> hate fast food. I know, I know, guys, I have like, what do we eat? Like the kava sometimes and Starbucks. I guess it's technically considered fast food, but I hate fast food. I just because I, I also don't eat meat so there's really nothing what am I gonna get some fries <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like I don't have any of this I don't drink soda I hate soda I have like a passion for <laughs> hating soda so there's some swig it's also <laughs> they can never get this stuff yeah they love this swig place too never heard of that I guess that's never but they love it here but Dutch Bros is always yeah. packed it line. is look at this line guys people are obsessed with Dutch Bros <laughs> I mean, I like their protein cold brew was good. Yeah, it's. Ooh, they got like cool summer stuff. It's like, would you rather 
Besides Starbucks. Oh, look at those teas. You would like that. Would you rather get like that or would you rather go to like a cool coffee shop somewhere? Oh, we don't you have know? those. Yes, but we drive to that. We have to fuck, we have to travel <laughs> so far. Yeah, I just hate the chains. I know Starbucks is a chain and I know Kava is a chain. I don't want to hear about it. It's just, I don't know. I like what I like and that's what I like and that's that. Pretty much. <laughs> Oh gosh, I'm like ridiculous. There's no Dunkin'. <laughs> Thank God. I have to go like into Houston to get Dunkin'. My mom had a mantra when we were younger. Anytime she saw a Dunkin', she'd be like, ooh, Dana runs from Dunkin'. <laughs> I hate Dunkin'. Hate it. Especially after working in New York in the city and how disgusting those Dunkin's are. Like, so skeevy and just so disgusting. <laughs> skeevy. Ugh. Ugh. Sometimes I like, sometimes I was craving like a Dunkin'. I mean, when we had to do like an overnight, like, and that's the only thing no open, but it's it's just you feel you feel it just you feel disgusting. <laughs> I know people I love Dunkin'. I'm not like a change. You know, I, you like what you like. If you like it, go for gold. I don't care. <laughs> I, you could like it all you want. I I don't know. It's just, I'm not about it. I, I don't, actually like the Dunkin' cold brew's taste. I've Thank actually you. never had a Dunkin' cold brew. I've never had it. Only their iced coffee, which is. Literally guys, it's their hot coffee from and it just gets cold and they use it for their cold coffee the next day <laughs> Like their syrups also gross me out because they're like this thick thing yeah. and like a huge jug And I'm like, oh my gosh you fill up like half the cup with the syrup Ugh. Ugh, but I've never had their cold brew so maybe we should do like a a series on here where I try things <laughs> from other places and like you guys can like see my reaction. <laughs> All fast food. Because I'm like really dramatic. But it would only be like fries. Fries. I don't eat meat and I would never get like a fast food fish sandwich. Like, ugh. <laughs> yeah, ever. Like Canes is my favorite thing ever now. Oh god. I don't really have them up north. It's the yeah. best thing ever. You couldn't eat that. You would just eat fries and bread, I guess. Yeah. He really wants like, what, what is that book? He wants me to take me to like a barbecue place. And I'm like, what am I gonna oh, eat from like? I want to do these days off. I want to go to Harlem. Yeah, okay. Make a note of it though. We have to like yeah. write it down. But he, yeah, he wants to take me. He, he already went like every time people visit, he brings them there, and I just sit in the car. Because what am I gonna do at a barbecue place? He's like, I can eat some some little like There's macaroni salad. More. There's more. Yeah, you get mac and cheese. There's actually more. You so can rude. Eat. I get like the sides, which is like coleslaw mac. And I'm cheese. gonna do it it's for him. On Friday we'll go. It's kind of a meal. I mean, that is like my favorite things at like a barbecue. And I'm just like, ooh, can you just like toast a bun for me and like make a grilled cheese? <laughs> but, you know, whatever guys. That's my rant on hating uh, a lot of things. All right, so you want your puppuccini? Excuse me. Your puppuccini? Oh, puppuccini! He arm. holds on to my arm because he's like, don't move. Look that is mine. Look at T, He's crazy. He's having a puppuccini. That's his favorite. Right in front of the camera. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. Look She's at like, that. Whoa. Puppuccini. Well, T, you devoured it. <laughs> Riella is amazed. She's like, what? He could have that? Oh look, he's just petting his head, first time ever. Wow, you actually got the petting. You wanna hold it? TT, you wanna hold it? Oh, hold it for him, hold. Let him lick it. Give it to TT, let him lick. Yeah, you gotta hold it. <laughs> okay, all right. Guys, these Millie Moon diapers are so cute. They have like little sloths on them. So cute. I know I've read, I don't know, some people say, obviously that they love Millie Moon, other people say, you know, they don't, I don't know. But there's just, I don't know, there's so many things out there, I don't know, but it's hard to know, it's hard to know. You just wanna give your babies the best stuff. 
but I did like the Huggies, like the Dalmatian, like the organic diapers, but they didn't have them. So let's see the difference between this size three. Yeah, Millie Moon runs huge. This is Costco size three, Millie Moon size three. It's like fatter. That's why she never really fit into Millie Moon. But maybe this, the bigness of this will be good for how much she tinkles. So I'll let you guys know how they, um, how they fare for her, especially for overnight. But it's funny, like it's just how convenient Costco is. It's just what we've been using. But I actually finally hung this mirror up yesterday. And um, yeah. It was an all-day affair. I could not get these nails lined up. I don't know. I don't know. It used to be, I feel like I I have everything, every measuring thing you could have, and I measured a thousand times, and it still, it still didn't add up. Right, Bree? still didn't add up. Say, I don't know why. Say, I don't know. I don't know why. Very annoying. Yeah? Where's Piggy? Where's Piggy? I want to hang up that and like another thing. Piggy! <laughs> Hi. What is that? Look, you see yourself? Look. Who is that? That's Briella. Yeah! Oh! Silly girl. Silly, silly. I love you. You love Piggy? Yeah, you love your Piggy. Hey guys, it is the next day. I literally didn't even end this vlog. I was just, actually not the next day. It's the next, next day, because I didn't film yesterday. It was the 4th of July. Um, but I didn't end the vlog. I was editing it, and me and Vin just talked so much in the car that this vlog is so long, so sorry about that. But, you know, we were just having a grand old time in the car, but I wanted, to show you guys the crafts that we made. So this one was just so cute. It's like a little flag, her little hand, like come on. <laughs> guys, I like die for these crafts. Like, oh, so cute. And then I did this one with all of our hands. So then mine and little Briella's. I didn't realize for her hand that white was like not gonna show up. So I had to kind of like Keep fill in a hand. little bit, but how cute. So little things to celebrate the fourth because we didn't do anything and worked and we just kind of relaxed honestly and then had a rough night because of the fireworks until like 1am so yeah but we're gonna end this vlog here